So we're looking at is your posture. So you could have a little bit more knee bend. Your back is pretty straight, which is good. So what we're looking for is the club to come straight back when you're making your shoulder turn coming back. And what I want to watch is that right leg and that right shoe. As you come back, the weight is transferring onto your right side. That leg's straightening out and the weight's rolling on the okay. right side of that shoe. There's also you usually cast or come over top of the and hit either a, a big cut and your leg separation see how much daylight is uh -huh. there right. so with that right knee is quiet you're going to pivot a lot easier around that right leg right. and get more energy with your lower body so the weight transfer onto your front foot will become much easier you're not depending on timing or anything so that's something you can work out that that right foot stays flat see how it's rolling over see, yeah. and that's something that's going to change your ball flight so if we can get that right leg a little quieter and uh -huh. that leg not straightening out like that you'll be able to come into the ball on the inside and it'll change your ball flight and you have a lot more distance with less effort okay so you're using your lower body in a better fashion but your hand-eye coordination is good so you're getting away with it so you can still get around the golf course mm. it's just a harder way to play the game gotcha.